In commemoration of the World Polio Day, leading music stars and celebrities from across West and Central Africa in collaboration with UNICEF has come together to release a new song titled No More Zero Dose to help bring childhood immunization back on track. The song brought together 12 of the region's top musicians and UNICEF champions to send a clear message that every child deserves to be protected by vaccines. Our correspondent Babaji Deli reports. The evening commemorates World Polio Day with a celebratory musical performance that powerfully calls for action. Representatives from UNICEF in Nigeria, West and Central Africa and the Lagos State Government emphasize the urgent need to reach unvaccinated children and protect them from preventable diseases. Every child deserves a healthy start in life. Every child has the right to life-saving vaccines that can protect them from preventable diseases. Yet, in Nigeria, we still have 2.1 million children that are zero dose, meaning they have never ever received one dose of vaccine. 80% of affected children by variant polio in the world are in just nine West and Central African uh, countries in 2024, which means we still have a lot to do in West and Central Africa. With nearly 4.3 million children in the region lacking access to vital vaccines, the No More Zero Dose song delivers a rousing call to action through the medium of music. I'm super, super excited that we're actually doing something more positive this time around. We can do something collectively, collaborate, you know, and I think more um, countries and regions in Africa need to do this if we really, really want to kick out polio and stop deceiving ourselves that mission accomplished. This occasion acknowledges the progress made in combating polio. Since 1988, the number of polio cases has decreased by 99%. This achievement is a testament to the tireless efforts of the global immunization led by organizations such as the World Health Organization, UNICEF, and the Global Polio Eradication Initiative which has seen a remarkable drop in the number of polio cases worldwide. The song brought together 12 of the region's top musicians and UNICEF champions, including Kobams, Alinu, Kate Encho, Omawumi, King Madi, Spyro, Stanlieno, Timidakolu, Waje, among others, delivering a powerful message that every child deserves access to vaccination. A group of friends who are not deterred by um, any form of language barrier, um, who recognize themselves as humans and as Africans, um, who understand that their music is a tool for change and have chosen of their own volition to use it as such. It's a song that will be easily mimed and people can use that to spread the message because it's so, so important to give every child the opportunity to grow properly and to contribute, contribute positively to the society. If we have to shout it, paste it on our forehead, say it as often as we can, we should. In every language possible. Papers, blogs, in whatever form that we have to spread this, we should spread it. We are saving lives and we are giving them a fighting chance in this society. In recent years, the West and Central African region has been battling with multiple outbreaks of vaccine-preventable diseases. However, by fusing vibrant musical songs with messages of hope, love and protection, these artists aim to inspire listeners to join the movement to safeguard the well-being of every child. Babajideli, STV News, Lagos.